At the heart of the dense plasma focus are two cylindrical electrodes, only a few inches across, nested inside each other. The electrodes are enclosed in a vacuum chamber, with a low pressure gas filling the space between them. A pulse of electricity from a capacitor bank, an energy storage device, is discharged across the electrodes. For a few millionths of a second, an intense current flows from the outer to the inner electrodes and ionizes the gas. Instabilities first compress the plasma into dense filaments. These filaments are little whirlwinds of current. The sheath of filaments merges together into a dense pinch or focus, combining all the filaments into one. This filament kinks and twists itself into a tiny dense ball, only a few thousandths of an inch across, called the plasmoid. Instability in the plasmoid creates powerful beams in opposite directions. Positively charged nuclei stream in one direction and electrons in the other. Rapid compression heats the trapped plasma to billions of degrees, hot enough to fuse nuclei together to release fusion energy. In sum, the DPF operates by using electric current to induce a plasma state in a fuel gas. It then leverages a series of instabilities within the plasma to bring about controlled nuclear fusion. We call this focus fusion.